Hey everyone, it's Canvas Craze Creations, Brandy here, and I'm coming at you with my challenge entry number 17 to my almost 300 subby challenge, which I am now at 313. And this is by Crafty Mama, which I am using her package as an example, guys, because she um, uses stamps.com just like me, and we print our own postage through PayPal or, you know, through stamps.com. So anyway... Some odd reason the post office has, you know, gone up on rates, they say, and this, that, and I don't understand half of it. I only know is that in the last month I've paid more money on my own packages to come to me <laughs> than I have on the ones going out. Well, this is what's going on, guys, like, because I'm part of swaps and I'm paying for those, you know, challenges as well. Again, though, I'm not going to, you know, blast people and say, hey, I had to pay this much. It's not about the money. The man will knock on your door, and if you don't have the money, I mean, he's even told me he'll take pennies. I had a $20 bill one day, and he's like, I don't have change. He made me go all the way to the post office to pick it up, you know? And if I'm not there to say, hey, please, can you come back on Monday? I'll Now I carry a little, like, Mentos container with change and ones so I can get my mail. Because it's a pain in the rear for him to just, I call it a tease, you know, come to my door with a package and then say, oh. I want, I need a dollar thirty-four or I'm not going to give it to you. So basically what's happening is, Crafty Mama's package right here is an eight ounce package. So she paid, I can guarantee, three dollars or three thirty. Which is a bubble envelope and it's what they call thick. Okay. Now, I have packages coming in that people have only paid a dollar eighty-two. What's happening is if you're using those um, kiosks, you're saying that it's flat, but a bubble envelope is not flat. This is what a flat envelope looks like, guys. Got a package of stickers in it. Totally flat. There's nothing. I mean, let me see. Even if you had this in there, and it was just bubble a little bit, it's 330. It's a thick envelope. So yeah, and a lot of people don't know that. And so what's happening is, I don't know if it's happening to anybody else, but... It's happened to me five times this month that I've had to pay to get my own package out of post office. Oh, I won't say the word. <laughs> but, um, so I figured I would help people out here, um, you know, because it kind of stinks if you're, you know, sending into a challenge and, they're and the person's having to pay for it. I would want to know if I'm making you pay, you know, I would like to pay you <laughs> what you had to pay because it's just not fair. So I figured I would come out with that because I had a perfect example with Crafty Mama is how I, um, like I said, is how I um, package mine and that's how you weigh it and you, know, you just don't say it's flat because if you say it's flat to save on the postage guys, it's going to cost the person getting it. A lot of people send it back. See, I can't send it back because then I feel horrible. So I just pay the price. So I would like to open Crafty Mama's package now and see what she has created. And Crafty Mama, I'm sorry for the delay. I've had a horrible week, but I challenge isn't going to be pulled, guys, until November 15th. So, got about 10 days to go. Um, if you can whip a challenge entry in the mail, go for it. <coughs> for those who have not entered, you are missing out big time. Because, again, I'm always full of surprises. I'm looking for scissors, guys, like always. I am yeah, full of surprises because it's going to be a pretty big prize um, of choices, guys. I had to save, you know, I can't tell you everything. But I hope you would have tried to, you know, win. Because it's also part of Christmas because I'm not doing um, any Christmas challenges for my son. You know, maybe the puzzle in the, the card or something, um, a cash value, but I'm not doing anything spectacular. Okay, so I've got a card here. Canvas Craze Creations Brandy. Thank you. And she's congratulating me on reaching over 300. I'm glad to be a member of part of your YouTube family. I enjoy watching the hauls, these sashes, and more that you share with us on your channel. Hope you like my challenge items, and I'm sure I will, Crafty Mama. Okay. I think me and Crafty Mama go way back to when I first began. She... I actually bought my D-Stash, and that's how she became one of my um, subscribers who is um, very supporting with commenting and watching my videos and 
you know, being a friend. And she has sent, um, these are some die cuts. They say, beware, and they're Halloween, and pumpkins, in the word, rest in peace, boo, and beware. So then she's um, gifted me these beads and things, which the beads um, and these, which I'm about to show you, charms, are um, your bonus points. So she sent me these charms, guys, and these beads, and those two entries alone are worth 20 apiece, so she just got 40 just for those. See what I mean? That's how easy this challenge was. But a lot of people, I noticed, didn't want to take the chance, so... The ones that got in, boy, guys, you are going to be lucky. All right, so I'm opening another package here, and it's a pocket letter, and it's Halloween. And I can see it's just gorgeous, see? She's got, like, the mixed media going on with this painting stuff. I am, I'm envying you, but no way. I cannot paint. You should see the walls. You should see the woodwork. I hit the ceiling. Yeah, I got to go over it with white. I think painting so much work, guys. More work than riding a bike, taking a walk. <laughs> yeah, I'd go show you. Paint is not for everybody. But I'm also left handed and a Polak, so I tell everybody that's what it is two left feet. Although my son, my middle son, funny as story, he goes to um, reach something, goes back up, and his whole head goes right across the wall. Yep, you got some white hair going on. And then ask me if it's off. You can't wipe off paint. Hope you enjoy this pocket letter, your friend Crafty Mama. I do. I I definitely love this. This I'm checking out the back. Definitely a nice pocket letter, Crafty Mama. It's always a pleasure when you enter my challenges. I love creations, guys. You could have you could have created me a postcard, and I would have loved it. I'm actually working on the wall um, this week. Are uh, there everybody's creations that I'm hanging up? Because, I mean, I got quite a bit of um, banner pieces and items to hang up. So I took down um, my mirror, and that was about five feet by five feet. So, yeah, I got a big wall space now. I'm just not sure if I'm going to hit it with a coat of paint yet or not. And then I got um, from Lee the dream catcher. So I'm trying to get all that up. And the um, clipboards and cork boards on that side, because I still got um, items hanging all over the place from my last challenge, my 50 subbies. So, so she's uh, all right. So she's created the um, Halloween, which I had stated. If you created a Halloween, you got or Christmas or holiday one, you got 10 points instead of the five. So she's got the 10, and then she's created the Christmas one. So she got another 10. I mean, come on, guys, 20, 40, 60 points she's gotten this. And then I got to count her goodies. And that's how easy this challenge was. It wasn't very hard. Put it this way. I'm satisfied with who entered because I got some beautiful um, drawing entries. People have, you know, really gone above and beyond for me. And I am up to 17 people as of right now. I have two more people. So even if I had the 19 people, I still feel rich. Um, my 50 subby, though, I had a lot more. I don't know how I lost, you know, people entering the challenge, but maybe they don't like it. I like cash, though, or boxes, but not everybody, I guess. Again, though, I know you've got other ones that, you know, you got to enter first, and I've heard it all, you know, but I try to, you know, at least um, the ones that enter mine, I try to enter theirs. And this is key right here. It says, Brandy, hope your holidays are filled with glitter. <laughs> it's cute. It's got me some decaf um, ginger man tea there. I think these are some button um, shaker cords. Very nice crafting mama. I'm going to get off here because I'm chatty catty here. And I'm going to get the um, number 18 comes from um, Janet Ramirez, which I got to go back and look. Um, I forgot her YouTube name. So I gotta go get her IC card because she's entered my um, challenge in the past, my 50 subby. I'm gonna get her card and I will be right back with challenge entry number 18. Thank you. <laughs> 